Hello, Parallelpreneur Powerhouses, and welcome to this week's Math Nugget, where I share with you one tip that will inspire you to act and motivate you to move. So the power of writing down goals and why tangibility fuels motivation. So let's get into it today. There is definitely something powerful about putting pen to paper. Those who know me know I constantly keep a pen and paper handy. I always have my planner because I'm always writing things down. It's just very good to get it out your head and kind of get it on paper, right? And so when it comes to achieving your dreams, tangibly writing those goals down and prints them onto your subconscious and acting as a constant reminder of whenever you are See them that this is what I want to achieve. This is what I want to accomplish for my life or for my business. Now, studies show that people who journal about their ambitions are 42% more likely to achieve them. So are you journaling about your ambitions? Are you journaling about your dreams? Are you journaling about your money milestones? Also, tracking that progress kind of triggers your brain's reward system, right? Who doesn't like a reward for a job well done? So giving you that rush of dopamine each time you tick off an item, Who are you guilty of this? Are you guilty of writing things on your to-do list or just writing some task out just so you can go back and you've already completed it, but just so you can go back and check it off? I am. I do it a lot. I'd be like, oh, what did I do today? And I go back and write down everything that I did and bam, I check it off. And that makes me feel so, so good, right? So if you do that, And this momentum will continue and keeps you motivated and keeps you going when it comes to you want to achieve these uh, big audacious goals, uh, audacious goals that you may have. Also, whether you write down yearly targets or monthly objectives or even just have daily checklists, visible reminders keep you accountable. Place them around your home or in your workspace or in your office to kind of re- repeatedly reinforce what it is that you're looking to achieve for yourself. The physicality of actually writing these goals also makes them feel more concrete and within grasp versus just them being thoughts right? There's nothing like writing it down compared to just being a thought, oh, I someday one day want to do this. I someday one day want to do that. But when you actually write it down, it's something about that. So if you feel your determination wavering, get to writing. If you're saying, hey, I want to start this this thing and you've been wavering about it, it's time to write it down. You're saying, hey, you want to lose weight. You say, hey, you want to start this all-inclusive coaching experience. Write it down. So print out photos about it. Represent the major milestones that help, will help you also stick to these things. Place it on your bathroom mirror, mirror or put it as screensavers on your phone or your desktop. Jot down your weekly task inside of a planner. Sketch mind maps if that's kind of your thing and how you like to kind of get it out of your head and how you're going to reach that next level. Give your dreams physical form to finally achieve them. So if you're struggling to stay on track with your goals, feel free to reach out with me and comment. I am. I am. In, I'm in. I'm sorry. I'm in, and then I can support you in um, getting those goals out of your head onto paper and mapping out what you need to do to achieve them. And for those who don't know me, I am Nefertira Fonde. I'm the owner of Go Get It Inc. I'm a certified business and sales coach for parallel entrepreneurs. Those are professionals who are building a service based business alongside their career. I help them get clear, get confident, and get cash into their business. And I would love to connect with you. So feel free to connect with me on all social media platforms at Nefertira Fonde. Until the next time, be profitable and be blessed. Bye for now.